Breathing is fundamental. We can go without food and water for a short time, but breathing we can only go without for a few minutes. It is also one of the things that is affected most by emotional changes. We often notice our breathing changes when we are having an emotional reaction to something. This can also affect our heart rate. It is one of the first signs that perhaps something is not quite right. Breathing is one of the most effective ways to help us stay calm and focused. Breathing techniques are not just for spiritual people or hippies, they are for everyone. Breathing techniques are one of the best skills to master as you don't need any equipment. And no one even has to notice that that is what you are doing to stay calm and focused. By practicing deep, calm breaths, we can let go of any emotions that are taking hold of us and stay focused in the here and now. To practice some breathing techniques, we're going to start with this one first. You can either lay down or sit up for this exercise. Of course, if you're going to lay down, please make sure you have plenty of room. Okay, so to start, place your hands gently on your stomach. So they're gently touching. Take in a deep breath through your nose and out through your mouth. As you notice your breath going into your body, you will feel your stomach inflate like a balloon. As you exhale through your mouth, you will feel your stomach flatten again. Let's try this together. Let's go over this again. So we're going to breathe in through our nose and out through our mouth. We're going to notice our stomach inflate and flatten with each breath. You can do this several times until you start to feel more calm and focused. If you notice your mind starts to focus on other things, then gently bring it back to your breath. We're now going to look at another breathing technique called square breathing. So if you imagine a box, like so, we're going to inhale through our nose, hold, Exhale through our mouth and hold again. You repeat this until you feel calm and focused. We're going to look at one more breathing technique and this is called five finger breathing. So if you hold up your hand, you can use your hand to focus your breath. So we're going to breathe in through our nose and out through our mouth. In and out. In and out. In and out. You can use these breathing techniques anywhere and the more you practice, the easier it becomes. Why don't you try this together now? Have a go at each of the breathing techniques that we've just looked at. <laughs> 